Welcome back. Wildlife Wednesday, one of our favorite days of the week for us and for our viewers. You get so many pictures, it's hard to choose. It is hard to choose. I'm more <laughs> than I could ever use. Yeah. So try to mix it up. I've got a good variety today. Uh, the subject of tonight's forecast focus. Heading down to Pullman to the Rudolph's place. Doug and Joanne, where they found this lazuli bunting enjoying their bird bath. They say he comes every day, takes a little bath, goes up and preens on a tree nearby. Adorable little darling. Here's a big bird, a black crowned night heron, uh, which is very rare to this area. But Terry Little uh, spotted this heron on Sprague Lake. And finally, a coyote from Mark Vogt, who was uh, out looking for lunch near Blanchard. Gorgeous, gorgeous animal. I'm very close to having these up on my Facebook page, plus a whole lot more. If you have never sent me a Wildlife Wednesday photo, I'd love to see it. Try to use as many as I can. Doppler radar right now showing the rain that has been fairly persistent over the Spokane area for the past few hours. This line of showers, some areas where it's a little bit heavier. We have had no reports of any lightning or hail, but it would not rule out the possibility of an embedded thunderstorm along this line sometime this evening. It is slowly moving off to the east and should be into the Coeur d'Alene area shortly, but it's sunny there right now. Rain right now in Spokane and 61 degrees. Just down the road, it's sunny and 71 in the Coeur d'Alene area, but not for long. Satellite and radar shows this stalled frontal boundary has not moved much over the past 12 hours. We'll get a reinforcing shot of wet weather tomorrow, mainly afternoon showers with the possibility of some thunderstorms. High temperatures across the nation are high of 72 in Spokane, one of the cooler spots on the map. It was 72 in Seattle today. Lots of 80s. That cold front is making its way to the east, however, so expect cooler weather in Boise, Billings, as well as Salt Lake. It's moving slow, as I mentioned. Satellite and radar shows scattered showers throughout the west. However, no real severe weather on our map today. Your seven-day forecast looks like this. Showers tomorrow with a high of 70 degrees. 70 on Friday and we're drying out. Sunshine on Saturday. Pretty good timing for an 80 degree and sunny day. And then more showers possible Sunday and Monday. No big day long rain events, but just a little bit here and there. Aww. And uh, again, those Wildlife Wednesday photos will be on my, uh, what is that, Facebook? Is that what yeah. the kids call it? The ki <laughs> I can't remember. 